Um, we were really proud to reopen the club uh, at the end of June. We had previously shut with the governor's stay-at-home order in March, but we realized that, you know, with the crisis continuing on for month after month, there really was a need amongst our youth and in our community of getting the kids back in a structured and educational environment, but also getting our families back to work. You know, with summer coming to Tahoe, so many of our families are employed in that leisure and tourism industry, and they were not gonna have an income unless they had somewhere safe for their kids to be during the day. The kids are kids have been amazing. Um, you know, you hear a lot in the media about kids won't wear masks, kids won't social distance. Um, that is not our experience. But on the whole, the kids have just been really incredible. And, and I think they get it, you know? They really understand that this is for their protection and the protection of their friends and the, the amazing staff members they love. Parents have been super, super supportive of the safety measures we've put in place. They really understand them. We do temperature checks on arrival, the mandatory masks, no toys from home, and really, you know, just adhering to good practices in their own lives to reduce the risk on the club. You know, they understand if they're out mixing and not wearing a mask at the weekends, that puts a risk on us. And our parents have been so compliant. We, we really appreciate them for that. They have just been so grateful for our ability to not only open this summer, but also now we're staying open through the fall. Our, our school district is returning to 100% online distance learning. And so, you know, for many of our families, that would have been a return to not being employed or having a, a drop in income. And so the parents are just really grateful that we're able to stay open and, and really help them keep their families on track. My experience here at the club has been nothing but one of um, joy and amazement at the community support we've been given. Um, we've had restaurants that cook meals for us so that we could feed the community while we were closed for kids. Um, we've had people donating to our scholarship fund, people uh, making cupcakes to feed the kids and also you know, support the staff. We have really felt the community love at this time. I take care of Tahoe by taking care of our youth. They are our future. They are our future leaders. They're our future business owners. They're our future community members. They're the future me. And I know that if we look after them, I'm looking after the future prosperity of this community and our beautiful environment. I keep Tahoe Blue because I want to preserve this community, I want to preserve this natural environment for the kids who are here today, but also for their kids and the kids that come after them. If we don't treat our natural environment right and we don't treat each other correctly, then we're not going to be preserving anything and we're going to have a breakdown in everything that's important to us. So that is why I promote stewardship amongst our kids here and I also want our wider community to really put Tahoe and its people at the center of everything they believe in and that they're working towards. Um, I think I have two things I ask is one, mask up. You know, whether you believe in it or not, just do it because what's the worst that can happen? You could save someone's life and you have, you know, a little bit of paper over your face for a while. Um, and the other thing I would say is we really need to stay united. You know, I, there's so much discourse right now about, you know, tourists and, and how bad they are. But then here I see our parents are, are literally making their living off those tourists. I don't want to see my families and my kids in poverty. So I see both sides of the coin. And I also think if we really come together and find workable solutions, that will speed this crisis up. That will get us through this and we'll be out of it and back to normal as soon as possible. So stay united, Tahoe.